Hello everybody and welcome to another game of risk. We are playing on uh the novice degree master rank up series to see how little of games we can get the grand master in. This will be game five. This is intermediate to grand master as we have hit intermediate last game. So, anyways, here we go. And also, uh, it looks like Risky Cam has joined in this game. Um, oh boy. He won't know it's me until, uh, this, this video gets posted, but it, it will be like a month later because I, I want to post the whole series together. Risky Cam did not confirm. Never mind. We're not playing. Okay. Never mind. We're not playing. He's not playing, so this is a five player game. Um, and the reason why I was gonna let him play is because this is not my main account. And uh, I guess that gives me an advantage, so that's kind of unfair. It's a good thing he didn't ready up then, so. Um, Burgundy looks like the spot to go because I don't wanna put it right on London. I think Burgundy is a good spot. Yeah, I'm gonna go Burgundy here. So it's a good it's a good cap spot. And purple didn't see my cap, so him putting it there. Ooh. That's interesting. You didn't see my cat pick, so that is kind of interesting. Black's a bot, so we don't know where he put his cap. Red red sees my cap and still puts his cap there. <laughs> Red's gonna hate me in the in the end game for sure. <clears throat> Purple and white, or I'm sorry, white and blue right next to each other. Holy crap. This is wild. I think, uh, I think we. I think we sit on that. 5v2 is too risky. I don't know. This this time I just don't feel like it's a good idea to hit a 2 with a 5. Even though it's 92%, I just, I don't know. I've removed black. He's the bot, so he's not going to add there. So, I don't know. I'm good. Ugh. <sighs> Black and white don't look like they're in a good position. Oh, I made the right decision because black added to Gascony. Yep. Okay. Black doesn't have a bonus either, but he has a lot of territory. So. Okay, I'm going to have to add like most of my troops to that. Oh, you're not that greedy. You are so greedy, bro. What? He took this and that. There's no way he holds that. What? I hope I see white break here because that's ridiculous. He's gonna go take behind, but he has to have Finland in order to get, hold this bonus in the top. Scandinavia, you have to hold Finland as well. All 
All right, we can go around looking at the players real quick. This is Melton Osei. This is Leopold. Le Leopold. One. This is Joggy Meow. Yeah, interesting name. Uh, Aquios Merildald. Merildald. Merilda. Aquaus. Aquaus Merilda. Yeah, there you go. I can say it. Aquios Meralda. Yeah. So all I need to add is one. Add the rest here. Make sure purple's removed. Come on. Nice. Well, I I gotta guarantee this is broken. He might get nine or something and I'll hit he might hit my cap, but you know what? He's holding too much. Nice. I mean, there was a chance he would have broke as well. The bot would have, but it's fine. I'd rather not take a chance on that. I think that purple is holding too much and probably could have taken my cap eventually there. Oh, he didn't hold a bonus at all. Oh, shoot. Okay. Well, good. Frick him. Oh, he's going to try to break me, isn't he? Yep, and he loses nothing. Nice. Nice. There's a the retaliation. Break you, purple. Yep. And now he's just going to hit me. Great. I also want to make sure I didn't have that. This is nice. Did Red get Red get it? No, he didn't. Of course he wins that. Nice. He's a lot of material to hit. Oh boy, purple just came out of nowhere in the bottom. That freaking sucks. He also used a lot of material to do it. White's gonna get the far right. Gonna like risk it. Dude, his cap is so weak, bro. Holy crap. Man, if I was holding a bonus, I'd get that. We don't know if purple took this or not. I'm I'm assuming not because he added like everything down there. And fortified it too. It's kind of hard to remove purple since he's already got such a. I need like insane dice to remove him here. I get, I get, I get five, seven, six, five, four, four, be two, there's nothing. I literally have to get like perfect dice to, to, to get him out of here. Oh boy. And he'll just take this bonus if I don't. He'll just remove, he'll just attack it. The seven v four. He's just going to attack it. Like I'll back up so he doesn't put everything into it. Put it right there. Oh, the bot gets eight. 
Oh shoot, he knows that he's not going to hold that anyway. Cool. That's why he's going to attack me. Nice. <sighs> Hopefully he doesn't hold that, because if he holds that, then he'll be able to sweep me out of here. We know Red doesn't have that because he didn't attack Ireland. I got five. Oh, it looks like he's cool now. Yeah, he left me alone. Okay. He might do the 2v1. He might. Red will probably take this bonus, both of these things now. And then red will be my problem. Two, three. Yep, he takes it. And he'll fortify that up to here. Red will 100% be my problem after that now. Oh boy. But I can't do anything about red until the end game because it's not worth it. He actually held that? Oh my god, that's insane. Two attacks. Three attacks. He sees he sees the blue cap now. Goes back. Blue's getting blue has the bottom. He's getting three. Unless he has the he might have the bot cap in the twelve territories. That could be possible. I, I doubt that though, because he's like surrounded on that cap up here. I need to make my cap a 12 and then the rest can go anywhere else for now. My cap is way too weak. I could break red, but it's so risky because I don't know where he's at mainly. So I, I think if I'm taking France, I am breaking red and holding my ground against him, but he would be getting seven. That's an eight on the territory. I would need at least eight on the territory. It's a risky play for sure. Nine, eight, seven, six, five. Five on the territory, fortify the four up, it's an eight. I would need perfect dice. If he sets on three, I'm bricked. Let's do it. You know what? Frick it, we're gonna do it. I mean, oh, it's going to be a seven now. He'll probably roll it. He'll probably roll the 8v7. And the bot might break me here, but let's hope he does not. <laughs> yep. It's going to break me. Yep. There it is. It was a risky play. I mean, what, what can we say, man? The bot broke me anyway. Purple's still not getting their bonus, but they're getting seven. So they definitely have, they definitely have the bot cap. Red's turn, does the 8v7 it? Nope, he doesn't. Where's he at? He's somewhere else. 3v1? Okay. You don't see a fortified to the 7. We're going to need to add a lot more to that 7 to make sure he can't hit it with a set. <sighs> Probably make it a 12 for that next turn, and then the next turn I'd make it a 20. If I can hold these two bonuses for a turn, I think I'll be good for the fifth one, the next one, the following one. White getting 13. He has this bonus attacking a lot. 13 for blue. He must have this. 
these this bonus and that bonus okay well done by blue <clears throat> Okay. Make this a 12, like I said. Best here, hit the four and the one. Now we're just gonna hit this. That should block against him. Okay. Only gets three. It won't hit a four. Or it won't hit a three with a with a, a four. Oh, but it sets in. Oh, don't add any more. It might roll the five d three. Oh shoot. Oh my. Ah, uh, frick! I should have left a four. Cause, oh my god, dude. Oh no, now he's adding down here. Oh shoot. Sets in early though. That's gonna give, oh shoot, dude. Red will 100% have enough troops to do it. Red will have enough troops to freaking hit my 12 if he sets it on four. Oh, thank God you failed that. Frick you purple. I, I should have freaking risked it, but if he would have taken that bonus, he would have seen my cap. But the bot had a freaking set, dude, on three or four, I mean. That makes sense. Oh, boy. White's getting 14. He has a lot of territory and his bonus in the top right. Red, red ignores my 12. I'm going to have to leave it like a 20 in order to block him. Maybe even a 25. <sighs> At least we know the bot won't be able to break us necessarily here. Most likely. <laughs> Unless it has a freaking bonus that we don't see. I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of in like a pickle here. I want to go down, but I don't, you know? Red's still getting cards, so he's on the outside somewhere. I don't know where. White almost got all that. White's the one with this. Oh, wow. He went into blue pretty hard then. No, he didn't. He just had, he had territory in that bonus and added to it. Okay. Red's got to be removed by now, right? From the outside. But he's got five cards anyway. Blue and white didn't set in. So, so white, red's not getting a big bonus or trade and he'll get like a 10. He'll get the 10 trade. Okay. So that's 17 troops. If I leave a 20, it's good. I leave a 20 stack there. He can't get out. Okay. Until until card skip. I have a set, of course. Yep. We'll use these guys. 20. I'm leaving a six just in case this bot has the freaking bonus. <sighs> Dude, I hate how weak my cap is right now. <laughs> if red gets another card here, he's got, he's somewhere out there, but if he doesn't, then he's blocked behind me.
I don't want to fight purple, but I know I can win the war against purple. Also, black did not get a card. So red cannot get out, even with the set. That's all of him. Yep. Nice. So he doesn't have anywhere else to get out. Oh, shoot. Yeah, we're going to have issues. <laughs> oh, boy. I don't even have a set to do anything, but I am getting a lot of troops. Yeah, we're in trouble. So I have to take a car with my six, put everything on cap. At this point, that's all I can do. Yeah, that's all of red. That's all. We see all of him there. So my, my turn is literally everything on cap. Take a car with a six. Go back to cap. I will be blocking my cap if I do this, though. That's the only downside to it. All right. Well, I risked. I risked. I risked. Part that red do these things. So, I mean, I can kill him on three. I want to. He'll probably break my two bonuses here. Blue's attacking far on the right there. I could make him hit that, but if he gets good dice, it's like, trick me, you know? I mean, but after that, I could easily... Maybe it's better to put it on cap. I mean, if he, if I do this and he fail, and he gets really, like, even dice, he still is able to break. I think I put it here. And of course the bot was there. So I'm going to put this back here. In case, in case red doesn't break me, that's why I'm doing it. But I'm probably still going to get broken by red. Nice. Okay, purple has bottom left. He's gonna take the bonus right next to me. No, he's not. He doesn't like opening my cap. Cool. No one has died yet, surprisingly. Now we'll see Angry Red come out with his 28. And he breaks. Okay. He's going to keep going. Nice. Yeah. Please stop now. There's no reason to keep... I'm going to smack your trap. Your troops on freaking on the stack now. Now, now purple knows. He hits purple. <laughs> oh, boy. Red's dead. Now I'm going to remove him from the pocket now. He's hitting as many territories as he can at this moment. I gotta make sure not to feed him, but the thing is, is that uh, red, that purple will get the bounty if I remove him from the pocket in the top. But if he sets on three, I'm fricked. I'm absolutely fricked. If I have a set, I do. I could set in to protect both capitals so that if he does set in he can't just yoink it from me just for protection before i kill him 
and just to be safe because he could have a set on three. I am getting a small set for this, but it might be worth it. Oh, blue's going up there. Okay, I think I think we'll kill red. I think we will. And if we don't, I'll be surprised. He's like, yeah, I mean, there's no point. There's no point in keep going, bro. Oh, he could take the cap and fortify up. Hmm, he's gonna... I think that's good. All right, well, I mean, even if we did not get the bounty, even if we didn't, we're still holding all this. I think blue will attack me though. And black has four cards. I am, I am risking my life right now. <laughs> Oh shoot. Someone kills black, someone kills red, I'm dead. <laughs> like this is bad. Purple will probably kill black now. Or red. If they kill red, it's better because they they end their turn on five. So that's better. They kill red here. Nope, they're gonna kill black. I'm dead. Aw oh, dude. He's gonna go up and he's gonna hit my cap. He sets in again, he hits my cap, dude. I'm dead. For sure. 30 troops. No. Is he going to leave me alone? He's going to kill red. He's going to kill red, dude. If he kills red, he's freaking good. Oh my god. Holy frick. He is watching. He can see it. Is he going to hit me now? We don't know. Fortifying. Fortifies back. He doesn't put it on this capital. He leaves this one empty. Oh, shoot. Well played. I mean, he's in a huge lead, but... You know... Hopefully blue doesn't attack me. I'm going to need to take Spain and France. So I don't think I'll break Italy. I think I'll just leave that. I'll just take the card on Spain like I'm just taking a card, acting like it. Then put like five or six troops down here to take those three and then fortify the four to this cap. Okay, blue didn't set in. I'm very weak, very, very weak, and purple is ahead of me in cards. And we'll fortify the four to capital. I'm still super weak. I'm going to have to set on three if I have it. I don't. Oh, shoot. Sets are at 40. White and blue still haven't set in. Why is purple's cap so weak? I don't know. Is he going to hit me? Yeah. Why? Leave me alone. I'm so fricked. He's going to leave it right on Gascony. I am, I'm so fricked. Like, there's no other way to explain this. He knows he's going to win this battle. Yeah. He knows. Yeah, it's, it's got to be a good game if I don't, 
I need to set on four. I, I mean, he's probably going to set on four and, and just annihilate me, though. Oh, shoot. Purple played it very well. I didn't expect that from them, honestly. Well, I guess all I can do is hope he gets broken. <laughs> like, what, what else am I going to do, you know? Blue dies. Yo. Oh my gosh. Okay, that gives another set of giving purple a bigger set. Come on. Show it. It's like 50 now, right? 40 cards. 47. Yeah, he's getting the 50 set. That would kill me. They both have two. He's going to try to anyway, isn't he? He doesn't have a set. He's going to try. I bet he still tries. He has like 100. There'll be 100 troops. He doesn't. He leaves me alone. Oh my goodness. And I have no set. <laughs> At least he already set in though. Holy shoot, dude. <laughs> he blocked my capital. I think he's afraid of white, but white's got five cards anyway, so. <clears throat> Holy frick, white could kill me. Okay. White could actually kill me. Let's hope he has no set on three. Well, uh, we're just going to attack up because... Because purple will probably retaliate here. He has enough troops to hit a lot of territory, so he should he should be able to do a lot here. He left his cap weak most of the game, so it's it's honestly his fault. How how big was that cap when he hit it? Probably like a 50? Was it a 50? Might have been a 29, I'm not sure. I don't remember. White hit something really big for that. If he sets in, he could kill me. I think. Yeah, he could. I don't think he even knows that. Oh shoot. If I see that 33 get smacked here. Purple should be huge though, because they double set in one turn or triple set in one turn. There's oh my god. Dude is smacking purple. I gotta hit white. I can't sit here. I don't think he actually realizes I'm weaker th than I look. We're gonna do that. I think we just go all the way down here. Take my time. Don't want to drag any attention to me. I'm the weakest. Don't need to expend anymore. I think we'll leave a 20. Just like give a good amount to be staying here. I need to be able to hit white here soon.
Purple sets on three. Oh my goodness. Please don't hit my 20. It's early game, so bonuses matter still. And C sets are still not that big. I have a set on three if I need it. I have a good cap, but it's blocked. That's the problem right now. White only gets 10. Holy moly. Purple and them are hitting a lot. We might be able to take the Vienna, Vienna cap here. I mean, it's a very risky play, but that cap is basically the big game. I mean, there's like Liev cap as well. Let's go explore down here because I haven't seen everything. Oh, okay. That's one, two, three, four, five, six caps. They each have two. Okay. And we'll pull this guy back because it's literally doing nothing. Removed white from the bottom left. Maybe purple likes that. Maybe they don't. I'm not sure. Okay, purple's chilling. I think he feels kind of weak. Um, why is there 24 troops of purple off cap? I'm not sure. Okay. Potentially kill white. I've opened purple a lot here. All right, purple's moving into me. Wow, purple. I have five cards. I think I could kill white here. I mean, white, how much, how much did white get last turn? Start with eight. So yeah, this is it. Should be good. That should be good. That can kill him. Let's 
See how bad the first one is. Pretty decent. Nice. It might be a bad play, but I am trying to get this game going. Thirty five, that'll get back there. He sets him in trouble. Oh, yeah. That was perfect. All right. He has a set, I mean. And there it is. <laughs> there it is. Oh, shoot. You lucky son of a gun. I have no set on board. Good game. <laughs> wow. He's pretty slow, though. Like, very slow. So there might be a chance just because he's so slow. Loses 53. Oh my gosh. I can break him. He's going looking at all the caps. There's nothing on this capital. He's fast enough to break. Going very slow though. Very slow. So I just take the cap back. Okay, thank you. That's enough to be enough to break. Cool. 42 is only in that way. 53 is not connected to my 15. So we're going to pull this to here because this is aim is important. Nice. I think we get him. He's he's a little bit too slow and doesn't know what to do. He also lost a lot of troops on my 20 something cap. So <laughs> I think we get him because his 53 is blocked. Can't really do anything. He could be using that right now. He probably will use it, though. He sees the 14, he's probably like, oh my frick. He needs to use his 53 while he can. I mean, I, I can't block him right now because his 53 caps open and his 43 caps open. My... Uh, my first trade-in will be sitting stuff on capital so he doesn't do anything. Provides that the cap. Great. Great. Perfect. Okay. That should be good. That should be good. I oh, will do that this way. That should be good. Oh, okay. Cool. Sick. Um, we'll just put this on app. Like that. And he's only getting, he's not even getting double digits. We're going to be just fine. I'm a card ahead now. He's really got to get good dice just to get over there. Be using his 93 right now. 2v1. Fail. Good game. Give him, give him some bad hope for it. 
Ugh. He's splitting. He's going to get the breaks, but he will not. He's going to lose. I think he loses 43 cap right now. He might. I mean, if I have a set for sure. Nope. Okay. He's really slow, though. So, I mean, I'm not even worried now. He's so slow. Fortify back to capital. There you go. 69. Don't have the dab. Okay. Um... That should be good. There's no reason adding behind. <coughs> oh. All right. Like that. No set, good. No set on four. Oh, that's two in a row. Oh, shoot. Dude, he's not even breaking it. Like there's, he already broke it. <laughs> oh shoot, that's hilarious. Locks his cap. Oh shoot. Locks his capital. And making it a lot weaker. Breaking bonuses though. I can take it. Nice. 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 Make him hit a cap. He, he doesn't want to hit caps, of course. He's got set. Yep. There it is. 95. You won't be able to do anything. We're slowly getting him down. That's good. He's weak. I set it and I just remove it again. And I can't block him yet. Can't triple tap him. He's gonna split the 69. If he splits the 69, I think I just win because I'll, I'll take all the caps. Oh no, okay. So then he leaves the cap open and that was a waste. Cool. Thanks. Can I just win the game here? Be risky for that. I think. I think Brick. <laughs> oh boy. I mean, he has two cards, so. Yeah, ignore the plus four, go to the plus three. Yeah, good, good job, big noob. Good job. <laughs> ignore the plus four, go to the plus three. Great.
I think I have a, if I set on four, I win here. Okay, good. I can win the game. Really accomplishing a lot getting down there. Oh, he gave up. Cool. Yeah, he's done. Good game. All right, guys. Thank you guys for watching this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you want to see more of this, please subscribe and follow. And yeah. Thank you guys for watching. This is a Grandmaster, Masters, and Intermediate. So we played some higher level class here. Um, okay. I mean, this was supposed to be just intermediate plus, and we got a lot bigger than that. So this is uh, fifth game. Uh, so we had one intermediate. I am technically also intermediate, but I'm not counting those because I'm already intermediate. So two masters, one grand master. And one bot. Okay. Okay, we're eight thousand and twenty six. So now still intermediate. Do the math on this. We gained seven one thousand seven hundred and twenty one rank points. Cool. All right, cool. So after five games, we're at eight thousand points. Right? After five games? Yeah, five games we're at eight thousand. So we're averaging around uh sixteen to seventeen hundred points per game. That's really good. That's a good average. I'll take it. Surprised to see some of the players were grandmasters and masters. That's freaking crazy. Because uh, it's an intermediate plus game. I mean, yeah, they're bound to join. But anyways, uh, to Risky Cam being in my game, um, I'm glad you didn't ready up because it would have been unfair for, for you because I, knew, I know you are. But I would have played it like a normal thing. I wouldn't have tried to target you. I just play it like I would play it. But I shouldn't be doing that. It's not fair still because I know who you are. So that is why I'm glad you did not ready up. <laughs> I should have kicked you. All right. Thank you guys for watching this video. I'll see you guys later. Peace.